Wow, would you look at that?
I'm just a poor old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. It's tough just to...
be sure. What do you want? It's my boy Sven you need to listen to. He sings at the inn most every night. Sven has the voice of a snowlark. Only good thing he got from his father. Whatever you need. Buy ye smear if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Show those thieves not to... The sooner you find the claw, the s <laughs> You found it! <laughs> I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Don't let my sister do anything foolish. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be.
Rorik stands a nice enough little hamlet with a boring posting for a guard. Ah, uh, huh? You see, the terminology is clearly first era or even earlier. I'm convinced this is a copy. Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. Seems you are a cut above the usual brutes the Jarl sends my way. That is where your job ends and mine begins. The work of the mind, sadly undervalued in Skyrim. My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. She discovered its location by means she has so far declined to share with me. So your information was correct after all. And we have our friend here to thank for recovering it for us. You went into Bleak Wait Falls Barrow and got that? Nice work. Just send me a copy when Far you decide it. Far I wonder what you Ira left is so excited about. A dragon's been sighted nearby. I want to you hear about this to. dragon. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't I know I want to hear about this it. dragon. Let's go. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the Dragon Stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to see this dragon. No, I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know I what envy you the ch So, you wish to master the arcane arts?
You know, if Don't you've got worry, the aptitude, I'm you the should join sober. the Major's College in Winterhold. Tried mercenary work? It might suit you. The guards in Dragon Street say you aided the yard. On behalf of White Run, I thank you. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened, and if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out, and look for survivors. We need to know what to do.
No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Crocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. God, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Quickly now. I don't know. I thought we were all dead for sure. Oh, I thought we were all... Get back! Dragonborn. All right, Dragon. then. What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. Old tales tell of the Dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Irla? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Irla. Tell us. Do you believe in this Dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. 
Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. If you really are Dragonborn, like out of the old tales, you ought to be able to shout. Can you? Have you tried? Go ahead. Try to shout. Have you tried to shout? Go ahead. Try to shout. Be careful. They say the Dragonborn can shout without any training. Like Talos himself. Have you tried to shout? They say the Dragonborn can shout without any training, like... himself. Boost! That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are Dragonborn. Summons the Thuum. Still here. I'll show you what I know. What do you want me to carry? I'll follow.
We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. We will be Still back. here. This is not over. What do you want me to carry? You fall. there. We're looking for someone in Whiterun. We'll pay good money for information. Kate Pitty, A woman. Sir, a foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in Whiterun. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. It's none of your concern. All you need. To if that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Almost forever. Ah, hello, my Khajiit friend. In the market for some hunting supplies. Bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman.
Thank you very much for your business. Hello, friend. In the market for some hunting supplies? Take a look. Farewell. Blade and shadow, silence and death. These are my arts. For a modest fee, I'll make great art for you. I know nothing of fear and nothing of remorse. Pay my fee. And together we will vanquish. If you change your mind, seek me out here. Ismir, you did it! You killed the dragon. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Sometimes I miss the soldier's life, but when I hold my daughter in my arms, I know I made the right. I can teach you a few things. It's a shame, isn't it? There has been talk amongst the gods that you are dragonborn. But such a thing, surely that's not good. Possible. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth, but there must be more to it than that. 
Dragonborn. What do you know about the Dragonborn? So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thum or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Hrothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rangar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Well, in the old tales, the dragonborn heroes would use the power of their voice to defeat the enemies of Skyrim. Wolfhearth was dragonborn. Talos, too, the founder of the Empire. Back in the good old days. In the very oldest tales, back from when there still were dragons in Skyrim. The Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. They're the masters of the way of the voice, of shouting. They live up on top of the throat of the world. If you're really Dragonborn, they'll want to talk to you. In the old stories, they always summon the Dragonborn for training. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you.
The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Looks like you've already got someone with you. Everything all right? 